So today we're taking a look at booting 19 computers cold using Wake on LAN. And we're going to be using iCafe Cloud and CC Boot Server to make this happen. So let's go ahead and take a look at our panel here in iCafe Cloud. We're in the boot menu. And as you can see, we have a number of PCs here. So these PCs all currently show as offline. So they are all off currently. But we want to turn them on. So let's go ahead and select all. And as you can see, every device has been tagged. And now we're going to go ahead and right click. And we are going to choose to power them on. And before I do that, I'm going to show you the physical arrangement so you can see that these machines actually are off. So we have a number of computers there, and then we also have a whole block of computers there. Well, let's go ahead and power them on and see what happens. Remember, everything is turned off, and I am not physically touching any power button. I am only operating this via software. Okay, so now every machine has been activated. Let's take a look. And as you can see, it is in fact booting to the CC boot server using the network. And there it goes. So let's take a look and see what happens. We're loading the image and Windows is booting nicely. We're gonna go ahead and try and keep some track of the boot time and I want to say the entire process is going to be only about two minutes or so. But it can be even faster depending on the hardware that you use, the network configuration, the software configuration, and so on. These are all loading. As you can see it's loading windows and once that is done you will see your iCafe cloud iCafe menu login so there you go took a little over two minutes not bad and everything is network booting we have no local drives in any of the computers here so that would be a demo of the amazing power of CC Boot and iCafe Cloud deployed to an eSports LAN gaming center. When set up and done properly, it's incredibly powerful. You have centralized management. And so I can go ahead and log in. And I am able to access games, load games, and have a complete experience for the customer. And it is incredibly powerful. This is a new setup, so we haven't configured everything yet, but as you can see, shiny new, nice games menu. Of course, you can customize and load any games you want. You also have play option where a customer can log in and play with their account, or you can use free to play where a house account is utilized. So let's go ahead and launch Counter-Strike and let's choose the house account and let's see what it does. And what you would expect is that it's going to go ahead and load Steam and then log you in automatically, which it now has just done. And of course, because all the game updates are happening on the server, we don't have to worry about individual PC updates ever. We can simply make updates on the server and that will push the game update to every machine. And as you can see, pretty quickly we were able to load CSGO and it's just finishing the loading process right now. We've got uh, basically five-year-old equipment here in this example and runs surprisingly well considering 
Um, this is again from five years ago. But with more modern equipment and a better network setup and some other pieces, you can have this thing loading and booting in no time at all. So there's your full solution, per perfectly working, very smooth, and very happy with uh, the solution that they have here. With the young soft guys, they really came up with an incredible um, way of managing and running centers. It's uh, extremely powerful and very well done. Thank you for watching.